All right, so we have the zero water pitcher and we've used it at home and had great success. So uh, we decided that we would bring it on the road with us. And so um, I checked the campgrounds water. This is just straight from the faucet. And when I check the total dissolved solids, let's see, on and hold. It is at, whoops. Uh -oh. Something's going on with the whole thing, okay. So it was at 350. So that's pretty high. But the filter says that it should take it down. And it says, it says replace the filter if it's 0.6. So I put a brand new filter in before we left. So I ran it through once. This is the water that ran through already. I'm in the process of running it through a second time. So this is the first pass through the zero water. Turn it off, turn it back on. Okay, so we're at zero. And so now I'm going to put it in and press hold. And so it is at 105 after the first pass through the zero water. Now this water here, back in here, because I'm running it through a second time. So this water has is going through it a second time. So now I wanna see what it is a second pass through the zero water. Get that cleared. Okay. I'm going to stick it in and press hold. And at the second pass, we're at 41. So it's definitely working. But again, we're still not getting to the zero with a brand new filter. So that's our review on the zero water. Thanks.